Hey everyone, Tim here again, timscomputerfix.net. I have a screencast here for you. Now bear with me here guys because I am remoted into a computer here and there's also a thunderstorm going on at the time of this recording so you may hear a little bit of that but I must press on. This video is about an error that you may get in Windows 10 that says your Windows license will expire soon. You need to activate Windows in settings. So, in this case, if you go to settings, you'll see here that this is a Windows 10 home and the activation says that it is activated, but it says it's using your organization's activation service. So this could happen if, say, an OEM vendor decides to install a multi-volume license on several computers and he actually activates it with the wrong activation key. But uh, there are other reasons why this may happen, but uh, we're going to look into troubleshooting this and to see if we can resolve this issue. This particular customer has had this computer for over a year and just recently just started getting this error out of nowhere. The last product key ID that you entered can't be used on this copy of Windows. So at any rate, uh, we're going to try a few things to see if we can clear this up. So we'll go down here to the to the taskbar, right click and select task manager, and then we can hit file, run new task, and then we can type in here CMD, tick the box that says create to run as administrator, and then we can close off the task manager, and then we can type this command into the command prompt, and I'll have this command down in the comment section below, and we'll press enter. So what this will do is give you the activation key that was used to activate Windows. So what we want to do here is to copy this, Control C, so that copied it. And from that point we can close off the command prompt. And then we can press change product key. And then we can paste this product key, control V, and then click next. Activate Windows. By activating Windows, you get the best experience free from interruptions. And we'll click activate. And that now has, we've activated this copy of Windows, and that now has cleared up that error. You can see here it says Windows is activated with a digital license. So we no longer see that other error that we were getting about it being activated by using your organization's license. So that is there no longer. So that's how you fix that. We'll close this out and probably the best thing to do is to reboot this computer so there's another scenario where you may have used a Windows Home key to activate a Windows Pro install by accident and now you're getting that same error about losing activation. There is a way to repair that. Back to our activation page to kind of show you where we go from here. So you would use the same concept in that situation. You would hit uh, change product key here. And then what you would use is there's a website here that you can go to that has generic keys for Windows 10. Windows Home, Windows 10 Home, Pro, Single Language, and Enterprise. These are generic keys here. And what you would do is you would copy whatever key that you that you wanted to activate say say you've used a Windows Home key to, to try and activate 
a Windows Pro machine, you would have to first revert that home, Windows 10 home install with this home key. So you would select this key, then you would enter that here and click next. And then what that would do was act will actually temporarily activate your Windows to a Windows Home license for that install. But at that point, you can go ahead and change product key again and then use your Pro license to enter in here. If you try to do it without changing it to Home first, it won't work. And another little side note to say is that while you are trying to use the generic key on Windows, you want to disconnect it from the internet, pull that network plug or disconnect or shut down your wireless, and then use the generic key to activate. Once you activate it with the generic key, you can then go back, connect it back to the internet, and then change that key again to your Pro key, the original one you were trying to use, and hit next. And that should get you activated. So I hope that makes sense. A little bit confusing, but um, I hope that helps somebody out. I'm Tim with Tim's Computer Fix.net. Until next time, everyone, see you soon.